Hey, what's up? Patio tanks right here. Uh, I'm just gonna do a quick update on my fish. Um, everybody's doing pretty good. Um, I put a second uh, dose of high active in for about three, four days now. Uh, they seem to do a lot better. But this dude, I've been waiting for his color to come in ever since the fry stage uh, grown up to now. His, his color has not come in yet. I don't know when. And as for these, look pretty good. This dude has gone out of his cave and started looking more, more not so shy anymore, but he's still there. He's still at the shy stage. Um, and these guys are doing really well as well. But uh, today's gonna be more about this guy, or tonight's gonna be more about this guy. I put the, I've been feeding him uh, the JDL Platinum two times, and uh, Grand Sumo, along with the Chinese uh, food, and uh, Brian Shen, and uh, along with that high active. He's doing really great. Um, but if anybody could tell me how to heal that tail right there, you know, um, that'd be great. Besides uh, doing the actually slicing it or grooming it, bring him out and uh, slicing it a little bit. I'm waiting until he's bigger. Uh, but he's doing really good. Uh, he's in 20 gallon right now. Everything seems to be really, really good with him. His pearls are finally coming in. You see, uh, his cock had uh, pearls, but it wasn't that defined. Um, yeah, but he's, I just put the mirror right there, so he's going nuts right now. But he's super, super uh, phenomenal looking right now. now I'll, do, I'll do a review of uh, other fishes too, but this dude right here, I bought him off uh, a buddy of mine named Chris. Uh, I, I made a couple of new friends when I got into the hobby, and uh, this dude, he was a Kampha or, or a SRM female, breed with a SRD male monster cock, and uh, he came out like this. I was I was really surprised, and uh, this this is the brother, the brother of that fish, and the other other brothers they look totally different. This is the only dude that came out like this, so stoked. Um, Considering I got I got lucky, got lucky guy at getting this guy. He looks phenomenal. And, uh, his siblings didn't look nothing like him. And uh, same with his pearls. His pearl looks nothing like theirs too. They have like dotted pearls and a very small pearl. But this dude has a lot of pearls, and he's very red. So let me know what you think about this dude. Uh, hopefully he can be my like next top. Uh, he he is fertile. Um, he's only three months, but uh, this one time, one of my females, the white one, uh, you guys shot, saw last time, she had a very early laying egg accident, and uh, he was the only male that was big enough, so I just let him do their thing, and uh, they were fertile, but then uh, the, the, they got a little too aggressive and uh, ate some of the eggs, and uh, knocked some eggs. So it wasn't sticky anymore, but they were, they were good. But yeah, this dude looks phenomenal. Probably my best looking, uh, well, I wouldn't say best looking, but he's my favorite right now. And uh, if not for him, I wouldn't stay in the hobby this long. Because I'd be jumping from fish to fish, jumping beta, guppies, uh, rosewine sharks. Uh, I just got rid of my uh, goldfish little mini pond right there. I might get some koi and guppies into this one too, but who knows? <clears throat> this dude looks nice though. Uh, say hello to all these little fellas right here. I just recently got into this hobby not too long ago. Uh, five, four, four months right now. And he's doing good. I got these guys on a really good deal from my friend Chris, so shout out to him. Uh, he, he, he has a lot of great looking fish too. But yep, Patio takes just a quick update on this dude. Um, his breed, how, how he's doing. But yep, Patio takes.